Hello, and uh, welcome to this uh, screencastify of uh, adding lists to a Scratch project. Um, so, in this particular example, I'm uh, uh, just going to use importing a list um, from some data that I had found on the internet um, or uh, any sort of list that you have. Um, it's just a CSV file um, that you can import. And so the way to do that is uh, we go into our code, uh, we go down, we can see right here into our variables, and we have just a regular variable, uh, or here we're going to be using this to create a list. And so we're going to be doing a list of the splash pads of Ottawa, uh, because I went on to um, the uh, Ottawa website and was able to find uh, a CSV file of, of those particular of that particular data, um, and so now we can see it's it's uh, on our project. Um, but we're gonna so to import it, uh, we just to right click or on a uh, another device, Mac or Chromebook, you might have to two finger click, and the import option comes up there. So we're just gonna click on import. And then it's going to bring us our options here. And we're going to go down to our uh, CSV file. We're going to click on open. And there we are. I think that's them. Uh, yeah, that should be the, the ones that we want. And there we are. So we can, we can now use uh, anything that we want. Um, to go to the next uh, stage. So, for example, we want to randomly pick something um, from that particular uh, splash pad list. So we can just go into our looks. Um, oh, sorry, I'm in my backdrop. So I want to go into the diver. So the diver is going to say something. So we're going to uh, say something based on something from that list and we can pick randomly from that list um, what we want. So for example, say item number, but we don't know which one we want. So we're just going to pick one between one and whatever that particular item is. And so we can use the length of the splash pad in there. And so then if we press on that, so it looks like we got Big Bird Park. Now we're moving, then we go. So there we are. Nice little example of uh, how to use uh, importing lists and using them in this particular case. Thanks very much for watching.